Hi, I'm Sarah Beth. Welcome to Wedding Setting. Today, we're at one of Dallas's most iconic properties, the Hotel Adolphus. This hotel has truly stood the test of time and located within these walls are more than just history. It's the stories that made Dallas what it is today. And I can't wait to show you inside. Let's go. Wedding Setting, where we bring you inside our favorite spaces and places for your next event. We're literally opening the doors for you to view these unique, new, and historic luxury venues like you've never seen them before. From ballroom to boutique, aisle to altar, large to small, we welcome you to come on this journey with us. We're now inside this recently renovated lobby, and it's not the only thing to be updated. Nearly the whole hotel went through updates, including the exterior. Parking is the easiest as you pull right in front of the hotel and wait for valet. It's the same process for your event guests too. One of my favorite parts of the hotel is just how beautiful this lobby is. Oh, and look at this. These keys are original to the hotel and provide the perfect backdrop for the Adolphus team to welcome you here. Hi, thank you. I'm here to see Paula Fenner. Absolutely. Thank you. Hand-built by European craftsmen in the early 20th century, the Adolphus was the passion project of Anheuser-Busch co-founder Adolphus Busch. Since opening, this hotel has welcomed such esteemed guests, such as Presidents Jimmy Carter, Ronald Reagan, and George H.W. Bush, as well as British royalty, including Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip. As you head up these escalators, you'll notice this beautiful chandelier. It's the perfect way to remember the hotel's founder, Adolphus Busch. Starting at the top, you'll notice that the crown represents the king of beers. Then the eagles circle the light fixture that resembles Budweiser and the wheat hops at the bottom that create the beer. This is one of two chandeliers and the second hangs in the Budweiser Museum in St. Louis. And here we are at the pre-function or cocktail space to the largest ballroom on property, the Grand Ballroom. Let's head inside. This ballroom is actually rather large with its soaring 20-foot ceilings and can accommodate 360 guests for dinner and dancing or up to 500 for a standing reception. The room can also be split in half by closing the air wall so you can host your ceremony for 250 guests, then cocktail hour in the foyer while a quick room flip happens, then guests enter the ballroom stunned by the transformation. These chandeliers create a refinement and elegance to the space that's unlike any other. Some of Dallas's most unique weddings have happened within these walls. It's important to note that there are two staircases that lead to these ballrooms. It's convenient for two separate receptions, as the Adolphus team does such an amazing job directing guests to the right spaces and places. And here we are with Paula Fenner, the Director of Catering here at the Adolphus. Paula, tell us your story. How long have you been here for? You know, I've been very fortunate. I've been here 17 years. And I just, every day I walk in this hotel and it still feels new and I love it. Yes, it's, it's just amazing. What is your favorite update that has been completed so far? I love the whole new entrance of the hotel, you know, with autos being brand new, commerce being new as you come in. So I just love that new welcome that we have. Absolutely, and the barber shop as well. Yeah, the barber shop is a lot of fun. And tell me one of the fun stories that I've heard here. There's something about a fox. Ah, yes. So in commerce, our retail shop, Stetson created a hat for us called the Renard. During Prohibition, Renard the Fox would be out in front of the hotel. If he was out there, you can come in and drink, but if he was not out there, there was no drinking in the hotel. Oh my goodness, I love that story. We've got to bring that one back. Yeah. I think a fun party about that would be great. Absolutely, yeah, the Prohibition, Fox out on the invitations. That could be really love fun. <laughs> I would love that, okay. And um, now tell me something about, you know, the food and beverage team here. It's just amazing. So tell me a little bit about that. You know, what I love is that 
Everything that we do is more restaurant style and restaurant quality. Uh, everything is just finished off right before it goes out. We do more synchronized service, so all, the entire table gets served at one time. And it's just all fresh and original. And even a lot of times, we'll get recipes from families that have you know, a tradition that they really wanna have. So there's nothing that's set in stone. We just do it all different. I love that. And it's really that attention to detail that sets the Adolphus apart from other properties. So it's so amazing. Well, Paula, thank you for having us today. Thanks for allowing us to share your property. It's so it's such a special place in Dallas. Well, it is my pleasure and thank you for showing it to everybody. Yes. We appreciate it. Absolutely. Now, the most private and exclusive way to use this floor is to reserve both of these ballrooms, one for your ceremony and one for your reception. Now, this is Century Room, which is the second largest ballroom on property and can seat 200 for a plated dinner or 200 for a ceremony by closing the air wall. These 20-foot ceilings and 10-foot windows make this room the perfect space for any event. Ceremonies look best against this wall of mirrors. It provides the perfect backdrop and you can design your dream ceremony in this space. Speaking of dreamy, I can't wait to show you the most historic ballroom on property located on the 19th floor. Let's go. Fun fact, each reservation of one of the ballrooms comes with its own piano that the Adolphus team can have tuned for you on the day of your event. Before heading to the 19th floor, let's pause for a moment on the 7th. This floor gains you access to the Adolphus Spa, which, did you know, has a private bridal room? You can reserve this area for manis and petties with champagne and light bites provided by the catering team here at the hotel. What a fun way to start your wedding weekend. Also, it's a little known fact, when you reserve one of the ballrooms for your wedding, it includes a complimentary pool cabana to use any time throughout the year. Hello, bachelorette parties. Here we are, located on the 19th floor of the Adolphus Hotel. Now, if this floor feels a little more exclusive, that's because it is. Located on this floor is the Governor's Ballroom that we'll see next, and a three-bedroom private suite that you can reserve for your wedding weekend. This area is the cocktail hour space that's perfect for passing hors d'oeuvres and beverages. You can bring in lounge seating throughout this area to give your guest a warm, welcome feeling. And what's more warm and welcoming than lounge furniture, you may ask? Let me show you. It's these windows. These beautiful windows let all of the natural light flood into the space. If you're the type of couple that likes light, airy wedding style photos, I don't think that it gets much better than this. Now this was the original hotel ballroom that was recently renovated and brought back to life. The arched barrel vaulted ceilings are original to the space and the lights were designed to resemble the original ones. My favorite features are the ivory paneled walls and herringbone floors. Now it's a little more intimate than some of the other rooms that we've looked at and can seat 120 guests for dinner or 80 if you would like to have a band. It can also be reserved in partnership with the ballroom downstairs, and you can host your ceremony in this room. Now, one more stop on today's tour, some other options for your wedding weekend. Let's go check them out. City Hall Bar is the Adolphus's hotel lobby functioning bar, and it's usually available for your guests after your reception ends. But if you're searching for a private, exclusive after-party feeling, look no further than this space the beautifully appointed French room bar that can be reserved after 11 p.m. for private events. And here we are inside the French room, the last space on today's tour. This is the hotel's private fine dining restaurant, but it's also a stunning option for your reception. Everything inside of the French room is original, including the flooring, banisters, and the hand-blown chandelier. It's currently set for the hotel's ever popular tea service, but you can seat 65 with the in-house chairs or 100 with rental chairs and wall-to-wall -wall tables. If you'd like to host a band or a DJ in this space, 50 or 60 guests fit perfectly. Well, that's the end of our tour today at one of my favorite places to stay and play in Dallas. I hope this property resonated with you and you'll consider it for your next event. 
The catering team looks forward to welcoming you to the hotel soon. Thank you for joining us for this episode of Wedding Setting, the Hotel Adolphus. Here we are, a seated, seated. <laughs> It hurts. <laughs> Oops, I gotta wait till it closes. Oh. Located on this floor is, I messed it up, I'm sorry, ballroom. It's perfect, it's perfect space. Brought back to life. Originally, no, sorry. Then the ballrooms that we've previously see, seen. Oh, okay. Stunning option, no. Sorry. Private fine dining restaurant. Yeah.